to say that museums and live insects generally don't mix. Staff have worked hard to keep this bird store bug free for 80 years, yet upstairs they keep a colony of beetles that get fed birds for lunch. Curious, me too. And here we've got our colony of domestic beetles, which are busy eating the flesh off some bird skeletons for us. This is one that was started probably about a week ago, so there's not a lot left on this particular specimen, but the one next door to it I only put in this morning. So that's got quite a lot more happening. So what do the beetles actually do? Well, they actually do eat the flesh. They only eat dead flesh, though, not, not live. They're the scavengers that clean up after things when things are left dead at the side of the road, for instance. After flies have got them, then the domestic beetles will move in and clean the remains up. So uh, they're really effective at uh, cleaning the flesh off these birds for us. And do you just give them the bird whole? Well, we do have to strip the bird down. They don't like feathers and they don't like skin. And really, we should remove as much flesh off them as we possibly can. So how quickly can they clean up a bird's skeleton? Well, something that's fairly small, for instance, in, in the next box here, I've got something that I put in yesterday, which is quite a lot smaller. So in a day, they'll clean it down to that. So there's not a lot left. And it's almost ready to go back into the lab. Bird skeletons are really important in the research collection here. They're important for uh, looking at identification of species and for use with the fossil collection. So lots of scientists from all over the world might have access to these once they're completed. I have to say it's pretty hot in here. It is really hot in here. <laughs> they, they really need a, a, a warm temperature to be at their best, so around about 28 degrees we try and keep it at. And that seems to be the optimum temperature for the colony to survive well. And it's not only hot, but it's a bit smelly. I don't really get much of that. I've lost most of my sense of smell, so I'm sorry about that. It could be quite smelly, I guess, for somebody who's coming in here. Is it possible that some of these guys can escape and get into the collections next door? Well, we, we're really careful to avoid that. So this container is sealed, and anything that comes out of here goes into a sealed plastic bag, and then it goes into a freezer just to make sure that any remaining beetles that might be on the specimen are killed before we even start work on them. What's left is a valuable record that can be used for research and identification of all kinds of birds. Domestic beetles help clean the skeletons of birds such as sparrows, penguins, and even birds as big as an emu.